Hi guys, it's Kylie here, and today we are attempting to make Ublex Stress Balls. Now, as you can see, I'm attempting to open the cornstarch, and I've just resulted in ripping it. There we go, as you can see. Now, I'm about to pour the cornstarch into the thing. Now, what you do is you pour one bag of cornstarch into your bowl thingy, and I'd suggest... um using this measuring cup because it has the liquid pour thing at the end as you can see right there like right where my hand was and now you pour in some water as you can see you pour in some water a whole bottle isn't needed but we just used one because we made a lot of stress balls for what you need now you with your hands is recommended because it's easier and you don't want to ruin your utensils. With your hands, you squish it all together. You squish the cornstarch and the water together, and it will make an oobleck substance. Now, I'll show you what it looks like after the fact, but right now we're just going to add some more water So, because we didn't add enough the first time. There we go. And that's how you originally make the oobleck. Hi guys, it's Kylie here again. So this is what your oobleck is supposed to look like. It has the consistency of a solid and a liquid, a perfect mixture. So as you can see, if you bang your hand into it, it will not go in. But if you carefully scoop it up, your hand will go right in and scoop up the mixture. Stop the video. Now we are pouring the oobleck into a plastic bottle. You'll see why we do this in a second. Okay, stop. Hi guys, alright, so this is why we poured the oobleck into the bottle. You have to put the balloon over top of your bottle, so you can see the balloon is on the bottle, so you can, now, you can squeeze, squeeze the bottle, and the balloon will fill up with your oobleck, as you can see. Right there, see the balloon is filling up with the oobleck, and that's exactly what you want. Now be careful, because if you don't put the balloon on tight enough, the balloon will slide off, as you can see there. But don't worry, we didn't make that much of a mess, it's alright. <laughs> and now, after all your hard work, you have an oobleck stress ball. But, now, you, to make it even better, you put it inside of another balloon. So we're going to put a bl blue balloon inside of a silver. So, as you can see with my hands... I cut off the end of the silver balloon so you can put the one blue balloon that has your oobleck in it in. You do not put the oobleck in the silver balloon. You put the balloon inside the silver, inside the other silver balloon. And now you have the perfect stress ball. Yay! Congratulations! You did great! Love you guys! Au revoir! Hey guys, it's Kylie here. Now, that was the end of that video. I just want to say that I got this idea from an, from an amazing creator who does awesome DIYs. His link will be his the link to his video will be li linked in the description below. Thank you guys for watching. Au revoir.